Hi, Tyler from Interfidelity here at the 2015 Consumer Electronics Show. I'm in the Pass Labs booth. Yes, the mighty Pass Labs booth with Jem Samasandram. Hi, Jem. How you doing? Hi, how are you? And he's going to tell us about Pass Labs' new headphone amplifier that's about to come up. Why don't you tell us a little bit about it, Jem? Okay. This is something we've been working on for a while. It's actually not a regular headphone amplifier, it's based more on one of our power amps. Um, it's taken a while to, to come about, but it's, it's designed to drive almost any type of headphone. Uh, we've taken pains to be sure that we've followed, you know, ideals or standards we've based on our regular product line. Uh, it's a low feedback design. Um, it's all discrete, even the regulators are discrete. We've got a super low noise transformer that was custom designed by us, which has a Faraday shield and as well as new metal shielding. So we've, we've ten, taken a lot of pains to be sure that it's, it's, it's a super quiet device. We'll have two inputs and will also perform as a preamp. Uh, so if you decide not to listen to headphones, you can hit the switch and you can use it as a preamp. So this is a, a set of balanced and a set of unbalanced inputs? It's, it's, all, ba it's all unbalanced, sorry. So isn't was I saw some balanced. Uh, yeah, we have balanced inputs on, on this. But it was just a prototype. Ah, okay. At some later point, we might look at at, at a balance piece. Mm -hmm. But but major, we found that the majority of users for now have unbalanced setup. Mm -hmm. and, mm -hmm. and so this good is place first, to start. Yeah, this is first our yeah. first offering. Yeah. And uh, so you can uh, so the controls on the front are uh, for input one or input two. Input one, input two. We're probably going to add another control for. Um, the, the preamp selection. Yeah, preamp. And, uh, uh -huh. But the unit is designed to stay, stay on all the time. Mm -hmm. There's power switches in the back, like our other products. Mm -hmm. And um, it, we think it's a good piece. Yeah. Well, I, uh, you know, first of all, uh, uh, I've been hoping that Pass Labs would uh, produce a headphone amplifier because it's it's a company that is. Uh, heroic to me for uh, Nelson's uh, contributions to the DIY world over the mm -hmm. years and uh, just a general education uh, for enthusiasts with all the materials he puts online. Um, Ed, do you know uh, what? when will the this amplifier be coming out? We're looking at probably about three months. We've and got a few details to take care of right now. And the model number or is there a model number yet? Isn't, uh, that's still a work in progress. <laughs> <laughs> We no we we we'll, we for now it's it's called the Pass Headphone Amplifier. All right. We will give it a, a model designation pretty soon. And the expected price is there one? That's also in in the in the works. But I would guess say around three thousand. But don't hold me to it. No, yeah. I'm not you know in the loop on that. Yeah. Well, uh, whatever you guys end up asking for it, I'm sure it'll be absolutely worth it. Uh, I'm personally. Uh, I'm uh, going to stand in line and with my uh, uh, sleeping bag waiting uh, to get my hands on one of these because I would just uh, love to give one a try. Thank you very much, Thank Jam. I, I appreciate it. And congratulations. Uh, it's exciting to see you guys come out with a headphone amp. Well, thank you. Yeah. Okay. We'll see you guys at the next booth.